is trying to rob a train. A train robbery? Not on our watch. <laughs> we'll finish this later, Deputy Teddy. Yeah! <laughs> 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 Why steal from a train when I can steal an entire train? This is too easy. <laughs> what is Leo trying to steal from the train? The train is full of... train is full of gold. Don't worry, we'll stop him. Yeah! There! I'll climb onto the back of the train. <laughs> the sheriff. The sheriff, do you have a ticket for this train? <laughs> Howdy! Oh! I hope you know how to stop a train! <laughs> Broken. We need to get off the train. How? The same way I got here. <laughs> Looks like if I can't have the gold, no one can. <laughs> Next stop, jail. Huh? Get out soon, Sheriff. You'll see. Well, if you do, me and Deputy Clementine will be ready to stop you. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> and Deputy Teddy, too. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Caillou. Broccoli is good for you. I don't want broccoli. If you don't eat your vegetables, Caillou, you won't get any ice cream. Ice cream? Woohoo! Stop it, Rosie. I don't want broccoli. That's it, Caillou. Go to your room. No dessert. You're grounded. Fine. Mad. Hmm. 
Broccoli is so gross, Teddy. I hate it. I never want to eat it ever again. Oh, hello. Hello. Can Caillou come out and play with us? I'm sorry, Leo. Caillou isn't allowed out today. He's been oh. very naughty, so he's grounded. Oh, Caillou mad. Okay, we'll see him another day, I guess. <clears throat> Leo! Clementine! Wait there! I'll come down! No, Caillou! You'll get in trouble! I'm speaking to you. What do you think you're doing? I... I... just wanted to see my friends. You're grounded, Caillou. You were very naughty earlier. I know, but... No buts, Caillou. And you definitely shouldn't try to sneak out. What if you had gotten hurt? Or lost? We wouldn't have been there to help you. I... I... Uh, Sorry, I'm not allowed out today because I was bad earlier. Okay, Caillou. We'll see you another day. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to get so mad. And I'm sorry for scaring you, Rosie. Caillou, mad. It's okay, Caillou. Thank you for apologizing. I'll go back to my room now. Finish your broccoli. <gasps> now, kids, as you all know, every year the school puts on a performance to celebrate the holidays. This year, we'll be putting on a show to learn about all the different holiday traditions. But we already know about Christmas. Yes, Caillou. But not everyone celebrates Christmas. <laughs> there are lots of other winter holidays, like Hanukkah and Kwanzaa. 
Please take these scripts home and read them through with your parents. I can't believe Hanukkah's going to be part of the show. Hanukkah? Is that what Mrs. Martin was talking about? Yeah, look, that's a Star of David. It's a symbol of Judaism. Hanukkah is celebrated around the same time as Christmas, but instead of getting presents on one day, we get them for eight. <gasps> eight days of presents? Wow! <laughs> Daddy! Daddy! Did you know there are holidays other than Christmas? There's going to be a school show all about it. Oh, how exciting. There are so many different holidays from all around the world. Hey, why don't we all learn about the holidays and practice for the show? Yeah! On the first day of Hanukkah, Jewish people light a candle. And then they add one every day until there are eight. That's because when Jewish people defeated their mean king, they only had enough oil to light their menorah for one night. But it stayed lit for eight whole nights. Eight nights? How? It was a miracle. That's why sometimes we call Hanukkah the Festival of Lights. Daddy, can we have eight days of presents instead? <laughs> you know, Caillou, there's more to the holidays than presents. What all these holidays have in common is that they're all about celebrating love, kindness, mm. and having your friends and family around you. But presents are also nice. <laughs> okay, everyone, it's nearly time. Don't be nervous, try your best, and most importantly, have yeah! fun. <laughs> Kwanzaa started in 1966 to celebrate the first harvest of the season and is celebrated by people with African heritage. We do lots of singing and dancing and give gifts and light our special Kanara candles. The Dongji Festival takes place on the shortest day of the year. Every day after will be longer and bring more positive energy to the world. Oh, and we also get to eat a special dessert made out of rice called Tang Yuan. Yum! At Hanukkah, we light one candle every night for eight nights and give each other presents. We also sing and play with really old toys like dreidels. At Christmas, we celebrate when Jesus was born. We give each other gifts and feel grateful for the friends and family we have. The holidays are about bringing people together. Family, friends, and those who need a helping hand. And even though not everyone celebrates the same holidays, there are a lot of things that we all have in common. All of our holidays are about kindness and love and friendship and... Presents! <laughs>
Look at this, Caillou. Why is that window so tiny, Daddy? It's a window for an archer. From inside, there's plenty of room for arrows to go out. But on the outside, it's very hard to get an arrow in. So it keeps the archers safe. working on some magical projects for the king. What kind of projects? Well, the king wants me to make sure there's lots of food for all the people in the kingdom. Watch this. <laughs> wow, Caillou, that was really... on that spell a bit more. Uh-oh! We're under attack! in your own world there. I was. I was a wizard doing a spell and there was a giant and the magic spaghetti started to get really big and chase Leo. <laughs> <laughs> Caillou! 
Hi, Caillou! Hi, Caillou! Clever boys. <laughs> Daddy, can you look after Jason's backpack while we go to the bathroom? Of course. After my backpack. That was quick. <laughs> no problem, Jason. <laughs> Thanks for looking after my backpack. Can I get it back now? Jason, didn't I just give you your backpack? <laughs> no. We just got back. Oh, shoot. I'm so sorry, Jason. I don't know who I gave it to. <laughs> there. I think... Oh, of course. Jeffrey! <laughs> nice prank. <laughs> Do you want to meet my friend? <laughs> my name's Jason. Jason! That's me. Do you want to see a magic trick, Rosie? Jason! Ta-da! <gasps> Jason! <gasps> Jason! <laughs> Don't worry, Rosie. They're twins, see? They just look the same. <laughs> <laughs> My name's Jeffrey. <gasps> Jason's. <laughs> 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 hey, have you guys played Dig and Build 2 yet? Not yet. There's a new one? What is it? Yeah, in this one, you dig up dinosaur bones. Then you have to put the bones together to make a dinosaur skeleton. It's awesome. My mommy's taking me to get it this afternoon with my allowance. I can't wait. Mine too. Maybe we can go together. Caillou? Uh, I don't think I can. I don't have any money. Well, you better hurry, Caillou, or the store will run out. Mommy? Daddy? I need some money to buy a game. <laughs> well, Caillou, you know money doesn't grow on trees. You'll have to earn your extra money. What do you mean? Well, we'll give you an allowance to spend on whatever you like. <laughs> In exchange for you helping around the house doing some chores. That's called earning. Okay. What do I have to do? Let me think. Hmm. 
Here goes. Okay, Caillou, let's see how much you've earned this week. <gasps> Is it enough? Is it? Yes, Caillou, well done. We're very proud of all the work you did. Yes! Dig and build! Let's go, let's go! Quick, Mommy! Or they'll all be gone! <laughs> all right! All right! Here! We got the last one! You'd better buy it quick then, Caillou. Not quite, Caillou. Mr. Hinkle gave you five dollars for five boxes of cookies. You've only given him three. <gasps> yeah, that's not right, Caillou. Oh, sorry. So you have three. Here's four and five. <laughs> Thank you very much, Caillou and Clementine. Thanks, Mr. Hinkle. Yeah! Have a nice day. Wow, we already sold 10 boxes of cookies today. I wonder if we can sell 20. Or 30. Or 50. Or 100. <laughs> <laughs> Why is everyone yelling? It 
It's all right, you two. There's nothing to be afraid of. These people are marching. Marching? Why? People march when they're unhappy about something big and they want to change it. They march with signs to let the people in charge know how they feel. Why are they shouting so loudly? Yeah, what are they upset about? Well, they want to get everyone's attention. This is a protest to stand up against racism. What's racism? Oh, Mommy told me. Racism is when people are mean to each other because of their skin color. Right, Mom? That's right, Clementine. See, there was a time when you two wouldn't have been able to play together just because of the colors of your skin. Really? Yes. People with darker skin like me and Clementine were not allowed to do the same things as people with lighter skin like you, Caillou. You two wouldn't have been able to swim together or ride the bus together or even eat at restaurants together. But that's not fair. Lots of people agreed, Caillou. So they all marched together just like this and things changed and got better. So now you and Clementine can both play together and do all the same things. Oh! So marching is a good thing. It is, Clementine. Sometimes people are still mean to people with darker skin, like us. So all these people are trying to make things better. And when lots of different people all come together like this, they can change the whole world. Wow! Sorry. It's okay. Oh, hi, Caillou. Hi, Clementine. Hi, hi Jeffrey. Jeffrey. What are you doing with all that water? Me and my parents are passing them out to thirsty people on the march. That's so nice. Hey, you two. Should we get back to selling cookies? Well... Some of the people marching look kind of hungry. Could we give them some cookies? Oh, can we? Can we? I think that's a wonderful idea. We can spare a few boxes. Water! Water! Free water! Cookies! Cookies! Free cookies! <laughs> okay, Caillou, let's take that turn to the left and head back home. Got it. Hey, Daddy, race you home. Be careful, Caillou. It's a bit bumpy over there. What? <gasps> Caillou! Caillou, I'm Dr. Nguyen. We're just going to take a quick x-ray of your arm, okay? Uh. Well, Caillou, I'm afraid your arm is broken, so I'll need to be in a cast for six weeks.
Now, I'm just wrapping some padding around your arm before we put on the plaster so it won't hurt. Now you need to hold very still until this is dry, okay, Caillou? Otherwise it won't work. Uh, it's so heavy. It feels weird. <laughs> It'll feel a bit strange for a day or two, but I'm afraid it's the only way to make sure your arm gets better. You. <laughs> Very good, Caillou. But how about we try it for real? How about we try that police car next? <laughs> you are under arrest, mister. Oh no, Grandpa! Where are you going to take me? We're going downtown. I've got some questions for you. <laughs> that 
Actually, uh, I'm uh, much too tired to arrest anybody today. Hop out, Caillou. Grandpa, Grandpa, what's this one? That's a garbage truck, Caillou. <laughs> Come and take a look at this. Whoa! What happens to it after it's been crushed? Well, some of it goes to a big landfill, and the rest, like paper, plastic, and some metal, gets recycled. Which means it gets made into something completely new, hmm. so that it can be used again. Oh, Grandpa, this tractor is so big. Oh, this must be for really big farms. Well, let's hop in, Farmer Caillou. Well, I'd say we're going to have a good harvest this year, Farmer Caillou. Yep, lots of carrots and potatoes and, and, and candy. <laughs> candy? Wow, this must be a very special farm indeed. <laughs> <laughs> Say, we'd better get you home, Farmer Caillou. Hmm. Oh. Here, why don't you take these with you? Wow, thanks, Grandpa. I can't wait to show Mommy and Daddy. That Caillou, you'll break it. <laughs> oh, come on, it's time to explore. Let's go. <laughs> uh, uh, it's really high. 
Don't worry, Caillou. We're perfectly safe. Castle! Hmm. <laughs> Almost, Rosie. That's Buckingham Palace, where the Queen lives. A real palace? Oh, can we go, Mommy? Can we? Of course. This way. Shiny! And through here is Her Majesty's throne room. These were used, of course, as part of the Queen's coronation ceremony. What's a coronation ceremony? Coronation is when a member of the royal family becomes the king or queen. Cool. <gasps> and if you'll follow me through here is the gift shop. Huh? What? Hmm. Oh, hi there. What's your name? M Monty. Monty. Hi, Monty. I'm Caillou. It appears Monty rather likes you. He's so cute! Oh yes, and quite the handful. <laughs> Tell me, how did you find your way in here? <gasps> oh no! I was on a tour with my family, but they must have left without me. Oh, not to worry, Caillou. This place is so big, it's quite easy for one to get lost. The next stop on the tour is the gift shop, just through there. If you hurry, you'll catch them. Phew. Thank you. Bye, Monty. There you are, Caillou. I was on my way to find you. Sorry, Mommy. I got a bit lost, but a nice lady and her dog helped me. She sounds very kind. <gasps> oh, that looks just like Monty the dog. Can we get it? Sure, Caillou. Hey! That's the lady that helped me. Careful, there might be more traps. Come on! Close. 
get the diamond now. Idea. <gasps> this way. How are we going to get down there, Caillou? Looks like you guys are having fun. Yay! Oh, Rosie stole diamond. No, Rosie. Me and Sarah stole the. How did you? <laughs> you see, Mommy, I need to choose the right brush so that the egg doesn't crack. is too hard, but this one is nice and soft. Well done, Caillou. Do you like painting eggs, Mommy? I do, Caillou. But you know what I like even more? Hunting for eggs. Hunting for eggs? In the store? <laughs> no, no. In the garden. Why would you search the garden for eggs? We don't have a chicken. <gasps> do we? <laughs> no, but the eggs I'm talking about don't come from birds. They're sweeter than other eggs and very tasty. <gasps> These eggs are made of chocolate. And even better, they're delivered by the Easter Bunny. Easter Bunny? Yes, he's going to hop around the garden and hide Easter eggs for you to find. <laughs> The Easter Bunny is going to hide chocolate eggs in our garden? <laughs> yes, Caillou. So, time for bed. You'll need lots of sleep so you're ready for the egg hunt tomorrow. But how does the Easter Bunny get here? <laughs> Where does it keep all the eggs? Don't its paws get sore from carrying all the eggs? I think it's time to sleep now, Caillou. Close your eyes, and when you wake up, you can go hunting for eggs. The Easter Bunny won't come while you're awake. Mm. Mm. One little look won't hurt. Come on, 
Gilbert, we've got an Easter bunny to find. Too quick and a very good hider. We have him cornered now. Caillou, what are you doing outside at this time of night? Caillou, you should be in bed. It's very late, and you shouldn't be outside alone. Bye-bye, Easter Bunny. See you again 